Hi. So in today's video, I'm going to be baking Christmas cookies because I'm festive. We're gonna be making it from scratch. So I'm not just gonna be like buying a kit and just decorating the cookies. Like we're gonna make everything from scratch and I'm not a chef whatsoever. So we'll see how this goes. Okay, well now I have to melt butter. Three fourths cup. Is there like a measuring thing? How am I supposed to put that in a cup? Oh, it does, okay. So we're gonna put this in the microwave and then I gotta wash my hands again because they're all buttery. So let's pour this in now. Oh, why does the butter smell so weird? Oh, no, no, too much butter. Three fourths cup of brown sugar. How do you level it? People go like that. That's not doing anything. You know, I'll just pour it. Molasses. I have molasses. I don't think I can open this jar though. How do you even, wait, do you like open it with like, no, that's a bottle. We could try it. It didn't work. Just scratching the lid. Do you really just have to use brute force to just go like, oh. Well, that was easy. Oh, that's thick. Oh, I don't like that smell. Also, it's like, what time is it? 518 is already like pitch black outside. I mean, it's not like the lighting was great to begin with, even in the daytime. It was like, it's been raining for like the past few days. Really this much salt? Two teaspoons of cinnamon, okay. Okay, well, my camera just stopped recording automatically because like I reached a limit. So I'm not sure if you guys caught me putting in the ginger, but I put in two teaspoons of ginger. Now we need one teaspoon of allspice. I should probably close all these spices so in case I like knock them over, they don't like spill everywhere, but it's fine. Wait, what am I gonna mix with? Do I have a whisk? I do have a whisk, I just don't know where the whisk is. I almost got murdered by a cheese grater, but I got a whisk. Whoa, the butter is all bleh. There's so much molasses. I, it says to put that much, but I don't think it should be that much. Ow, it's like these little like chunky thingies in there. Crack an egg, okay. What is my dog doing? You good, buddy? I had my mom crack an egg for me because I would probably mess up and get eggshells everywhere. Pour that in. How are you supposed to mix? Do you just go like that? Or do you go like whoopee kaya? Like, what do you do? One teaspoon of baking powder. I can still smell that molasses, oh my gosh. Baking soda, we need half a teaspoon of that. Three and a half cups of flour. Okay, is that even enough? Is there enough in this little bag thing? Hopefully. I feel like this already is enough flour. There's so much stuck in the whisk. That's the only thing I don't like about using a whisk. Like everything gets stuck. Also, it's a Sunday night. Haven't done any homework yet. And school's tomorrow, so it's great. And I'm gonna start using this. Okay, now it seems like it's coming together a little bit more. It's been a while. I finished rolling it out. I wrapped it up in some like cling wrap and it said to put it in the refrigerator for about 30 minutes. So I did that. And by the way, that sound that you're hearing is the oven, which is preheating. So here it is. So it said that you can just like sprinkle some, I cleaned off the counter. So I'm just gonna sprinkle some flour and then I'll start rolling it out. I don't know how much I'm supposed to put. Is that enough? Is that too much? So now I have to roll this out somehow. Oh gosh, it's like cracking. How do you roll stuff out? Yeah, this does not look smooth like in the video. Also, I don't have cookie cutters, so I'm just gonna use a knife to like carve it out, I guess. <laughs> we'll see. Also, my camera's running out of battery, so I'm gonna switch to this camera so the mic quality might change a bit, but yeah, I'm gonna switch to this camera. I don't know how thin it should be. It says one fourth inch. Let me get my ruler. I'm gonna just start carving, I guess. Okay, and then we go like Oh, that's, that's not, it's fine. Oh gosh, I am butchering this. It's fine, let's make another one. I should have just bought cookie cutters. It's fine. You know, we're gonna start over. I literally don't know how to make a tree. These are such bad tree shapes, oh my God. Okay, uh, so I, I really did try to make nice shapes. This was the best I could get. We have a, a tree, another odd looking tree. We have my attempt at a gingerbread man and another attempt at a gingerbread man. And then we have a heart and then we have a star, which kind of reminds me of like one episode of SpongeBob SquarePants. 
I'll put an image here, but like. <laughs> the cookies have come out of the oven and I'm gonna decorate them. I made frosting myself with powdered sugar and milk. First candidate, the gingerbread man. Let's give it some buttons. Give it some shoes. Should I add more to it? I don't have like sprinkles and stuff. That was the one thing I forgot other than cookie cutters. Let's do the tree. Okay, so the tree obviously has to be green. This would have been nicer if I had sprinkles, but it's okay. Oh, wow, that's not bad. I just outlined the tree. Looks pretty decent. Okay, I guess we're adding ornaments now. There we go, we got a nice old Christmas tree. This is not snazzy, not snazzy at all. Okay, so I finally finished decorating these cookies. They look a little odd, I know. So we have this nice little Christmas tree. And then here we have Jerry. Yeah, so Jerry's just vibing over here. Then we have Patrick, Patrick Star from SpongeBob. And then we have this nice looking Christmas tree with some ornaments. And then we have a little heart. And then we have George. Uh-oh, looks like... <laughs> Looks like George had a little accident there. Yeah, that's George. I'm gonna eat this deformed Christmas tree. Oh, those are soft. Are it supposed to be soft? That's oh, okay. You know what? It actually tastes good. They're pretty fire, not gonna lie. I'm proud of myself. Like that was, that tastes good. Sure, the shape of the cookie was a little weird and the way I decorated them was a little weird. You know, I kind of feel bad if I ate George or Jerry. Or Patrick. Um, anyways, I gotta clean this all up. So, uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and uh, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.